We've become, in my household, the new gay cliche. <laughs> Mario and I are now <laughs> very much into going to antique stores. Yes! Oh, oh my God. <laughs> To the point where You're old gays, yeah, you become old gays. Like even when we went out of town recently, we're like, let's look up and see what the local antique stores yeah, are. What's oh my the scene? God. Let's see what the and now we go to like antique malls. So it's like where they have these different kiosks. Uh, <laughs> and what kind of stuff are you looking at? Like is everything? It, yeah, is, uh, like knickknacks, furniture. Ninety percent of it is crap I would never want, even if yeah. you gave it to me. So half of the thrill is to see what people want for crap. There was this oh, one that I went to this antique mall just this past weekend. You can go with my grandmother. I would. <laughs> and uh, they had a bowl of keys that didn't even look antique. It's like a Ford key, a Chevy key, a random key that had no mark. Keys, $5 each or two for eight. Like, who, who would buy that? And then we saw this one sculpture that we liked. It was a couple, like a pair of hands. It was awesome looking. Really cool. Twelve thousand dollars. Twelve thousand. That wasn't made of thousand dollars. I think it was. Might have been marble. Mm. Um, there are crappy old, I don't know, candlestick holders, dime a dozen, something that you would get at Goodwill for a quarter, mm -hmm. and they want like four hundred bucks for them. Who's buying this stuff? That's half the thrill. But I did spend at our most recent <laughs> outing to the <laughs> antique mall an inordinate <laughs> amount of time looking at. <laughs> Vintage salt and pepper shakers. Oh, wow. Vintage. And if, Vintage. And if I had a penny for every time either one of us said, look at this one. That's cute. Oh, look at that. That's cute. Oh, look at these. I mean, these are, are cute. Just those I would salt be and pepper shakers? a billionaire. Are they Versace? Uh, they're not Versace. They're little chickens. Um, but we ended up buying one salt and pepper shaker set, and it was oh. like, I think, 22 bucks. I'm like, oh, let's do Is that. Is it cute? It's so cute. There was a, a conversation in the office. You weren't in there for this, but um, there was a, a house, like a really that's huge house, like a yeah. mansion. And how come every time it's like a super big, expensive house, mm. it's always a bunch of gaudy, yeah, old, dark wood, everything. Like, the ceiling's dark wood. The walls are dark wood. The furniture that's all in is dark wood. It's like, that That seems to be like, for all, I would have to have them knock a million dollars off the cost just uh -huh. to remodel the place to get rid of all the dark wood that's like right. throughout yeah. the whole kitchen's dark wood. And Sam is like, I like that. And then mm -hmm. she goes down this whole conversation <laughs> rabbit hole of like, tell everybody what, what you've been online buying. Well, like, uh, vintage Pyrex dishes. Okay. Oh, my mom would love you. Oh my yeah. God. I'm so that? obsessed. I don't know what Isn't that, that is. Isn't that the white Pyrex. ones with they're, the, they're the like blue casserole flowers? dishes. Yeah, there's oh, all okay. different ones. You can get mixing bowls, and then there's the ones with the Cinderella kind of handles on the outside. And I <laughs> yes. really want the Cinderella mixing bowls in the gooseberry color. It's yeah. pink. It's so pretty, and I love it. What? But to get like a full <laughs> set of these mixing bowls is like $500. Yeah, not Jeez. Cheap. Yeah, they're from the 50s. I bet my mom expensive. has them. You have to come to Check out her house. Really? Yes. Is that like that lay? <laughs> She's been on the pirate lake who set? No, look, look it up. No, no these are like antiques. This vintage. is the kind of stuff. If that only you had the internet. My mess. grandparents had. Is that like Tupperware? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's 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 a glass. It's like a heavier glass. Uh, um, it's really good stuff. But these yeah, were that's all the, why it's these still all, out there for sale. These were all the rage amongst housewives in like right. the sixties and seventies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they have all these like weird patterns and stuff on them. Yeah. And apparently, it's big business online. I it. Yeah. People. Buying and selling this vintage Pyrex stuff. Yeah, so and, I did get some. I got some small little ones. And right. Sammy loved this house that uh, we were, that we were looking stuff. at. Yeah, it's just like it's like just so. It's fun too to see all the stuff gaudy. that you used to have. Remember those? Well, you probably don't. The clocks that were cats, and the eyes would go left and right, and then the tail oh, yeah. would swing. Yeah. You right. see those, and like those a are 50s diner, crazy <laughs> expensive. And I saw a Donald Duck hat that I used to have as a kid, where you squeeze oh. the bill and it. Like quacks, yeah. And I'm like, I had that hat. <laughs> I could be selling that. Now they want fifty dollars for it. What? I know. What? It's super fun, and it's such a cliche. But then after we left that antique mall, we we Googled uh, other antique stores nearby. So we like got in the car, drove to those. <laughs> like, oh, this one specializes in outdoor stuff. Oh, the, and then a tiny little marble, for lack of a better word, vase. It was more of a cylindrical vase. It didn't have a price tag on it. How much do you want for this? Oh, uh, let's just uh, go with two hundred. Wow, two hundred. See, I'm kind Give of disappointed, in you, Greg, because like I'm... we've always kind of bonded over like the more 
modern, modern like new, c- contemporary, sleek. but like more right. on the modern side or like the new, like you know, newer I, stuff. I, He's regressing. I not dumpy, it. not dumpy old crap. From, I get it. You'd always like, be what fun makes of that it cool stuff. just because it's I, it's. It's, 50 years old? It's fun to look at. Yeah, Maybe 50. Is she cool? Getting. Some of yes, the stuff is old. You. It's fun to look at. I don't <laughs> decorate my house with old crap, but it, sometimes yeah. it's fun to like put something old that looks cool and modern in a modern space. Hmm. It's fun. Because when you okay. walk around yeah. those places, they look like a Cracker Barrel. They, they do. They definitely yeah. do. And they're so <laughs> cluttered. They're so o- overpriced. Overpriced. I know, because my mom drugged me through those. And I, I, it was sucks as a kid, because you yeah. can't touch anything. You can't play with anything. I know. When I was a kid, that was torture. Oh, it, it was worse. Torture. Yeah. And then uh, the older I'm getting, I'm like, well, this is kind of fun. <laughs> oh. But <laughs> and that's God. why I said that's a gay cliche, yeah. because they love to go antiquing. Oh, but look at uh, you guys. Oh, babe. It, that's so cute, babe. It, <laughs> And then, oh, there was this one wall sconce, this one antique store. It had nothing but sconces. Menace, what's a sconce? A wall sconce? Look how lost he looks. <laughs> we brought this up recently. Wall sconce? Because I was like, sconce? And then you guys were like, come on. Come on. Uh, it's like sconce. a light. It's a light, light fixture a light that attaches to the wall. To the wall. Uh, okay. It doesn't hang from the ceiling. All it's right. on the it's wall. Glass. It's, kind of def- yeah. it's a, re- it's a diffuser, it. deflector, reflector. Yep. <laughs> they had thousands of them, and they were all old and crappy. 850 bucks for this old I'm like are you wow. who's buying this I don't know how any of them stay in business it's it's, it's really fun to look it, at oh they have vintage playboys yeah. they have like oh, vintage now we're talking. like playing cards vintage zippo lighters like you can find cool stuff yeah so i understand if it's like a knickknack or whatever but sammy when it comes to like these like mixing bowls and yes. stuff that's not something you just have in display. Like, would you use them? Yes. Yeah, I've already. You would. Yeah, I use them, and okay. then I do have them on display though as well. Nice. So they're on display. You that's can see look them super in my cool, kitchen. Right, Greg? Yes. <laughs> and, and I also use them. Okay. Dual purpose. Would you like to go antiquing sometime? <laughs> yes, oh, I do go fun. to antique shops and stuff yeah. too. I've yeah. Looked them up. They look like cool. hideous seventies. Oh, yeah. Well, they are. They're they're old timey. But you get matching colors to fit your decor. Yeah, right. you can get, you can get well, gooseberry. What, oh, yeah. I was going to say, what was the name of that color? Gooseberry. gooseberry. What? 